hello guys and welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to show you how you can bake skeleton changes directly to meshes using mesh Muffer. so first of all we will use queen as an example and we will go to create from pose uh, if uh, we want to make uh, this uh, character taller uh, we can grab a bone like i don't know spine zero four is fine and just make it uh, this is just a basic example I'm gonna show you uh, the results so uh, bear with me uh, then we click bake skeleton it will take a little bit for this to complete now uh, that our skeleton is baked uh, we can test it out of course uh, we will see that uh, the changes are reflected even in persona you can uh, uh, check out uh, the bones here as well and uh, also you can uh, test with an animation because that's the most important stuff we need the, the animations to uh, work correctly right so I'm gonna check the run animation first as you can see everything works fine uh, we will check also the walk animation as you can see uh, the animations uh, work uh, perfectly fine so this is a cool way to to modify uh, skeletons in uh, Unreal Engine using Mesh Muffer uh, also what uh, we can do is uh, modify uh, skeletons for metahumans uh, any changes uh, we made in uh, the poser here in uh, in the mesh morpher uh, it will uh, be written to dna assets uh, for the meta humans if ab if available right so uh, let's check it out let me close this and uh, i want to i want to hide a little bit uh, all these bones uh, because uh, i i really can't see anything right so i'm going to edit settings and uh, i'm going to deselect draw full bones you can also view uh, the results here as well right so let's check it out it, uh, the bones are a little bit uh, uh, big so let's uh, make it uh, smaller right so we can easily interact with them uh, let's uh, for our experiment here let's uh, also modify a little bit uh, the skeleton we will make the ears uh, lobes a little bit uh, longer and uh, let's modify the nose a little bit right uh, this is how it goes you can also make a script that writes uh, to a bone asset and uh, you can load the bone asset uh, in this uh, uh, dialog here and uh, you can programmatically create the bone asset and just uh, bake the bone asset to the skeleton right so it's up to you how uh, how clever you get with this right so i just uh, modified a little bit uh, just want to move uh, around the eyes here just a little bit i want to, to show you how it works and uh, now let's uh, hit the bake skeleton right gonna take also a little bit okay uh, the baking uh, is uh, completed and uh, let's check it out for metahumans as well I'm gonna I'm gonna hide uh, the bones here uh, they're too wide too, too big maybe we can make them smaller like this we can see anything i'm gonna just uh, hide them and uh, you can see our changes are visible as well for meta humans and uh, we can test it out with the uh, with an animation right again the most important thing so as you can see everything works fine and uh, yeah i think this is a, a very easy way to customize further your uh, to further customize uh, your skeletal meshes using Mesh Morpher, 
and you can get as uh, creative as you want by uh, being able to to modify the skeleton directly in the engine right i hope you find this uh, useful guys and uh, i really believe that uh, baking uh, skeleton changes uh, uh, directly in the engine using mesh muffler will uh, give you uh, the opportunity to customize as much as possible as you want uh, skeletal meshes in Unreal Engine. Don't forget that you can do this with MetaHumans. So the changes that uh, you bake are uh, written to the DNA asset uh, assigned uh, to the MetaHuman. So yeah, I hope uh, this uh, helps you and uh, see you around guys. Bye.